I have a question for you, dear teacher. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, on the point of entry, uh, specifically a fetus, when it's growing in the belly of the mother, uh, exactly what point does the soul enter? Mm. Is there like a, a, a few months or um, if you can go on YouTube? Depending upon the soul. Of course, the life has been planned. The soul contract between child and mother is set and in action. The soul is in the body and out of this fetus. It is important for the soul to become comfortable with its new home, but the new home is being custom built. So it is not so comfortable to stay for a long time, especially very early when it's a tiny cramped custom home that is full of construction, so to speak. The soul is in and out, but always connected, always connected. The mother, it is important for the mother to feel the baby's soul, of course. No mother wishes to carry a soulless being within her. The soul is there, in and out, but also the soul is stroking the mommy's cheeks and connecting with the father. You will be my father, be a good father. The soul is connecting with those in the environment and the family. And the soul is also becoming comfortable with the life path and the karmic lessons planned, giving energy to them. For once the soul is completely in the body, then the body forgets all the knowledge that the soul has and begins things anew. It may depend upon the child most children, the soul is integrated within a few months completely, but for some, it may be up to three years, six years before it's one, maybe 80%, 90%, and then hmm, more firm. But it depends upon the life planned and the experience of the soul. Of course, a younger soul, it is quicker. An older soul who is here for healing the earth, there will be a delay before it is 100%. Does that answer your question? Yes, because the question came about as in the context of abortion. Mm -hmm. So it is something we all have to, you know, we think about and it occurs. So, um, one of my teachers um, of yoga had told me that the soul doesn't get attached to the body until a certain timeline. Mm -hmm. So what you described as, you, as, well, the soul may not feel comfortable when it's really tiny little um, zygote, right? Um, constant but it will come evolution occurring, constant morphing, so much action. <laughs> Right. So if, if, if someone uh, terminates that life, right, um, mm -hmm. I, I'm just curious to know uh, at which point you, what you're saying it is from the very beginning. So it's from the very first inception, the baby is incepted, the soul is going in and out. Yes, however, even if the baby is to die within the first week after birth, it is no problem. Death is never a problem. Yeah. However, your soul does not hold moral judgment. No soul holds moral judgment over the death of a child 
the abortions, the miscarriages, there is no moral judgment, only your judgment, self-judgment, mm -hmm. society judgment. There is no soul judgment. There are some who their life contract is for only a few months within the mother. There are some who say, I will be the miscarriage. This may have been contracted before the mother was even born as part of the mother's lesson or the father's lesson. This is a difficult subject, but it is not uncommon for a soul contracted miscarriage. And then the soul of that child remains as a guardian over the future children or returns in maybe the next birth or the next, or is part of a lesson. We are not saying miscarriages and abortions are predetermined. The majority are not. We are saying that there is no trauma to the soul. Thank you for clarification of that because um, this particular teacher was claiming that if it if the termination occurs early enough, there is no soul within the body, which is not true. The soul is connected, but not in for the soul. Hmm has other work to do for the preparation of the life. And again, there is no trauma or distress. I understand that. Um, so, hmm. so at, at which point the soul is completely comfortable at the, um, like, which so-called trimester or something that is um, decides to find its permanent, um, uh, I say, I guess, residence. <laughs> this generally does not happen until after the birth of the child. Okay. Okay, good. Generally Thanks. a few weeks to a few months. I see. Sometimes longer. There are occasion when a soul wishes to spend the entire time in the zygote to embryo to baby. This is unusual and always by soul contract for the persona of the baby. However, no matter what the situation, there is no trauma to the soul. There is no black mark upon anyone's eternal tally sheet. Mm 